Hi, something a bit new for today. Andre is going to try an XX Light, a new wing uh, that our friend Olaf has brought. Uh, we've just had a good um, 20 or 30 minutes of untangling it because uh, it's really fine lines and a uh, single skin wing. Uh, but now it's untangled. Andre's just getting himself prepped, so we'll see how he gets on. Tell us about it. Well, it's super light. It uh, feels like just paper. The tension on the rises is kind of similar to a, to a full-size wing because it pulls you the same amount, but just when it's kind of down and you maneuvering it and pulling it up and stuff, it just, like any small breeze just catches it. It's really interesting. And he obviously, because it doesn't have any uh, internal pressure, you can't really use your brake to pump out the plate. The rise is super, super thin. So this one is the larger one, so it's the 18 meter squared, and it's uh, 1.6 kilos. Feels like underwear. <laughs> You need to go higher. Matching bra. This is a, a bra, yeah. <laughs> Third try. One, two. Yeah, oh, I should have some uh, orange. I should have some orange trousers so that it's uh, yeah. so you can see the blue. So you can't yes, adjust the no, nothing leg loop. The, the thing, chest is already there. Yeah, the only thing that you could adjust is the knot for the chest. Would it's you... terrible. <laughs> do you think it's 
think it might just be for this purpose or in general? No, I mean the the whole idea between um, the whole idea be behind really light wings and light harnesses is to run up a mountain and get to the top, take off, and come come down as a just sitting down as a descent mechanism. It's not really meant to be ground handled and stuff, but still, it feels kind of comfortable the harness until it re until you, if you're in an upright position, not sitting, but you're upright. And it starts to take up your weight, kind of like um, going into flight. And it has these um, has these these carbon carbon fiber rods. Has two of them. And I have no uh, and I have no nice way of putting this. It just goes right into your butthole. <laughs> so that I think deters anyone from taking off. I don't know what everything is on this. It looks like you haven't got anything on. No harness. Just a just a blue bikini. <laughs> hey, nice day, isn't it? It's an amazing day. I can't believe it. This is It's like summer. Like, yeah, a summer day. It's boiling. Right. Okay. So let's just I'm really uh not sure what the A's are. Uh, by the way, the A's and B's are together, so you can just pull the, the whole riser. Okay. Like the riser that is not attached to the brakes, basically. <laughs> okay, this is weird. <laughs> It's very different, isn't it? Yeah. First impressions? Uh, I think it's quite girly. It feels very light and very playful. You mean the wing? Yeah. I think the, it, the yeah. wing is girly. That's like the best review. No, okay. The most random Scrap review. that. That sounds stupid. No, I think that does sound pretty good. It's uh, playful. It's very playful. It's very nice. It's very different to another wing. It's, it doesn't do what you'd expect. I'm um, not like keen on the harness for the same reason as you but also for some frontal issues okay. that are going on right now that you have to keep. Definitely not one for just holding above your head is it? Yeah it doesn't, yeah. It doesn't like to stay. I did find that. <sighs> About the same weight as me and the wing is 18 meters so the wind has picked up a bit again and uh, makes it quite lively so that was a nice little experiment wasn't it yeah it's an interesting wing uh, i think you liked it more than me i think for me it's uh, maybe a little bit small for my weight it doesn't it doesn't react like a normal wing so much it has no internal pressure the wing, the, t the tips tuck in quite easily and you can't rely on feel so much. You actually have to look at it to see what's going on. But your experience was different. You quite liked it, didn't you? Yeah, I think it's very playful. I don't know whether I'd feel comfortable flying it, mm. but, um, but I liked having a play with it. And I think I'm probably lighter on it, a lot lighter mm. on it than you guys. So maybe that makes a difference. I don't know. What, what did you think about the flare? like how much energy there's in the glider to flare because typically that's the thing that is really do... hard about single skins is there's no energy there to bleed out but yeah i didn't do much of the flaring to be honest but it did keep me going for a little bit but mm. um for yeah me... I, don't, I didn't do it often enough to be able to comment yeah. i don't think for me i would just plow straight into the ground like and then <laughs> so and look at the bag that it packs into <laughs> yeah 
look at it. This is, uh, this is not the original bag. This is even smaller than the original bag. So it's definitely a, a, a tool for the right job, I think. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. Come, come what, and, don't come, get it tangled, whatever you do. Come and tell us, Olaf, what you thought, because you, you played around with it as well. Yeah. So what, what, what did you think? This is obviously the, the wing owner. This is the owner, thank you very much. <laughs> it's uh, Olaf, he came to, to fly with us here for a few days and he brought some uh, interesting toys that we might get to ex try in a different video. But what, what was your experience with it? We spent quite a lot of time untangling it. Yeah, exactly. And I already made up the name XX Lite, the double X for, stand for tangling. Yeah, extra, extra, <laughs> extra tangle. Extra, extra, extra tangle. tangle. And also light. So yeah. Yeah, it's yeah. just the third. Uh, um, option of it that it's light yeah. but it's super fast tangled it has all yeah. lines are red and yeah just landing it twisting it over yeah what did you, you what did you think about uh, ground handling how does it feel compared to your normal wing yeah it's uh, it, it has the pressure I was just standing there a lot a long time it was quite easy to keep it above me at least mm -hmm. I have to say compared to the seat which has much shorter lines yeah, um, yeah. the seat reacts super super fast but this reacts a bit more normal on the um, on the pressure yeah, yeah. I didn't fly with it yeah. uh, so I cannot say anything about it yeah. how it feels in the air but yeah we I had very limited conditions to yeah, try because it, it was very light and now it's very strong so yeah, it picked all up or nothing over a very short period of time yeah. we didn't pick up too much to, to test it out yeah. In uh, in any case, uh, thank you so much for watching and we want to thank all of these people here on Patreon on this side for supporting the channel. And, and as well uh, the guy behind it. And obviously Olaf, Olaf <laughs> for lending us the wing. We love trying new wings and new pieces of kit. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and we'll see you on the next one. Ciao. Bye. Bye. Uh, pretty cool to have more people in the Yay. video. <laughs>